barns often have odd numbers on their labels, such as 10-2-8-2-5-2-3-2. This is called the count system. For example, Nancy has selected a 5-2 cotton. But what do those numbers mean? The top number is the relative weight of the yarn. The higher the top number, the finer the yarn. So a 5-2 yarn is thinner than a 3-2 yarn. The bottom number is the number of plies. This yarn has two plies. This is a very old system that was established when each fiber had an industry trade group that was responsible for setting the standards on yarn sizes. For instance, the cotton group determined that their system would be based on a skein of yarn that measured 840 yards and weighed one pound. A size one took one skein to equal one pound. A size two would take two skeins to equal one pound. So let's revisit our 5-2 yarn. To determine its yardage, you would multiply 5 times 840 and divide the outcome by the number of plies. In our case, that's 2. Our 5-2 yarn has 2100 yards per pound. Wool, silk, and the other fibers establish their own count system on which their yardage systems are based. Today, this system seems a little nonsensical, but industry still uses this system to label their yarn, so we are stuck with it. You could spend a lot of time learning the count system, but it isn't necessary in order to gain information from these numbers. What we mostly need to know is the yards per pound in order to plan our projects and calculate yardage. We list the yardage right along with the yarn count number on our website. If you would like more information or have questions, please feel free to call or email one of our friendly staffers at the Woolery. Happy weaving!